Hello, welcome to another video. I'm so excited that you tuned in today because today I am setting up my weekly weekly planner, okay? Um, and it is super cute this time, you guys. I am super loving it because I've created some images that I um, am going to insert into this planner to make it look just spectacular, okay? So I'm starting off with setting up my year at a glance and I am uploading a few images that I created. They are the monthly calendars, okay? And if you would like to use these same cal calendars, I do have them listed below. I have actually all the images that I am going to use in this video today listed below, okay? So if you wanna know how to set up your planner, you could maybe use this uh, setup as a reference, okay? So um, yeah, it's just gonna be a weekly planner that has all the tasks and chores and dates and things that I am doing for this week all lodged into this planner, okay? Right now I am showing, I am setting up my current week and I'm adding a monthly calendar to represent the month that I am currently going to be planning for and I'm gonna write in the current week that I am planning for, okay? Then I'm gonna list a small um, habit tracker that I would like to uh, just keep track of some habits. Um, you can use this section as well as just listing some goals for this week or anything that you would like, okay? So just a few habits, um, nothing spectacular there. But um, now, we are looking at all the things. Now, when I say all the things, it's all the things that I typically do within a week or each day of the week, okay? I'm just writing down a few things. And yeah, these are single cards and I'm adding an image to make them kind of pop. And actually within the morning routine and the night routine, I'm gonna have a checklist on the inside of those just to go through that I can open it up and run through like a quick checklist and stuff like that. So um, it's something that I would put in my day um, every day when I go to set up my days of the week going across. It was something is something that I would add for each day, a morning routine and a night routine. So um, I am just setting those different boxes up um, where I run different errands, um, just stuff that you would normally do during the week. You might journal every day. You may have different ideas that come on certain days that you want to jot down, just different stuff like that. Now, um, the card template is just different chores that I typically do throughout the, the week. Um, I might have a specific one for each day, so I am just listing them down. They necessarily don't just have to be chores. They can be um, different little odds and end things that you might want to um, want to log into your your week. So that's pretty cool. So we got all our days of the week down and we have a done section at the end and an overview section, okay? So anything that you complete throughout the week, you just slide it over into your done section and the overview is for any highlights or notes that you want to um, record in that, in that section. Okay, and like I said, um, for the chores that I typically do, I have a section of each um, part of my house, the living room, bedroom, kitchen, dining room area, etc. And I just write a quick checklist to go just deeper into the things I might do in that particular area. So 
I thought that would be neat. Um, I may not do all the things in that area on a certain day, but I would check off the things that I did. And I can reference back and say, on this day, I did wipe the counters. So the next day, I'll, what, um, maybe clean out the, the oven or clean off the stove. Just different things, okay? So I'm just getting that together, and it's good, and I like it. <laughs> so that's that. But this is such a cute and simple way to plan out your week. And I will have the images that I use for this video in the description box below. Okay. And I think uh, just simplifying things make it uh, a little bit easier. So I'm excited about trying this setup for myself starting the first week in February and see how well it works for me. And if you like um, to set up yours this way, feel free to um, use this as inspiration. And um, yes, I think it's super, super um, cool the way it's set up. So I hope you enjoy this setup. Feel free to leave any questions that you might have. And until next time, we'll see you later.